my name is Alan Mitchell. I uh, spent uh, 45 years in fleet in both the public and private sectors. Well, there are at least two changes that I can think of. The first is uh, rapidly developing, developing a technology, and that is in uh, both uh, computerization of managing the fleet as well as telematics. And uh, that, besides that, I also uh, think that there's been a huge growth in the amount of regulation that's been in fleet since they got started. And I got to know the local, the state, and the national um, regulatory people and in the process. Um, well, it surrounds people mostly. Um, and by that I mean, I think one needs to be an active listener and spend a lot of time um, actively sitting down with the people and paying attention to exactly what they say rather than trying to multitask and look like you're not paying attention. And I think with the, by observing the body language and by uh, communicating uh, through expressions and so on, that you can actually uh, understand much more that way. The biggest challenge, again, is people, but at all levels, and it's customer service, I think, is one of the prime things, and uh, I learned this probably mid-career mostly, because being in the public sector, one doesn't always think that it's a customer service business, but it is, and it's the only reason you have for truly being. So as long as your budget is managed and, and everything else is managed, you have a job and you create jobs for the people that work for you. And, uh, and as long as you're making the customer happy, that's probably 90% of the job, and the other is uh, your own staff and getting executive management to be happy with your performance.